get yourself financially aware. Number one thing you can do right now and as you get older and as you graduate is find a way to create passive income. Does anybody know what that is? That's my point exactly, <laughs> okay? And I hate to say that, whether you know it and you just didn't raise your hand or you don't know it. School, as good as school is, and as good as those and as sharp as those professors are, they do not teach us one thing. They do not teach us how to make money. What do they teach us? How to get out of school and go get a job. That's what they teach. You know why? Because that's what they did. What do you think they do? They're professors. They work. They have a job. Some of them get paid very well. Some of them don't get paid well at all. I'm not saying they're good or bad people. I'm not knocking the education system. But I'm telling them to make you aware. You need to be financially aware. Financial awareness is so important. Passive income creation. If you can figure out a way, guys, to create passive income. Passive income means you're making money because you did thing one time and you make money over and over and over again from that one time effort. Passive income, okay? Passive income outweighing your monthly expenses. Don't matter what your monthly expenses are, you are considered financially free. And I promise you one thing, hear me loud and clear. You are not free until you're financially free. Give more and you get more. Find a way to give more and you will ultimately get more. You help, up and help out enough other people get what they want in life, you will get what you want. 1% of 100 people's effort is better than 100% of your own. Okay, so that's a team philosophy right there, right? You can't win this game by yourself. Baseball is the most individual team sport there is, right? It's you against the pitcher. It's you in the box. It's you on the mound. It's you underneath the fly ball in the outfield. It's you diving for the ball in the gap or in, in the five hole in the shortstop, picking, picking it up and throwing it out at first. It's you throwing that guy out of second base as a catcher. But it's your teammates that come together, right? It's the most independent team sport there is. It's pretty awesome. Last thing is we're going to do something as a company, my company. I own a company called Increase Clean Energy. It's one of my companies. I have a couple marketing companies. I have a couple international companies that specialize in gold and things like that. I want to give an open door opportunity for each one of you. As you graduate, as you get out of high school, or excuse me, as you get out for the summer and you're looking for some part-time income, um, some full-time stuff opportunities. I want to offer that as at least an interview opportunity, internship opportunity. Some of you guys are business people, business professionals, business majors that need internship uh, opportunities. My companies are credited. My companies are are available to be able to offer that to you. So as a ball player, I'm going to give you preference or preferential treatment to at least come in and have an interview, have an opportunity to work within our organization somehow, some way. So I want to offer that to you just as a vocal, just from me, one of the owners, and say, you know what, there might be an opportunity that some of you might be able to play a role with us down the road, who knows, right? We run a high-end sales team. Some of my guys make a couple hundred thousand dollars a year, right, in income, in sales. And some guys, some employees make 30, 50, 40,000 dollars a year. But ultimately, there's a lot of different opportunities, a lot of different ways. I wanna offer that to you as, as an alumni, as somebody that I'm proud to be back in, part of the organization with Joe and and uh, with with you know your staff here you guys have a great great staff and I'll tell you what you got a man at the helm that, that I respect I admire and I know he cares for you guys he cares a lot about this program he's doing everything possible to get get guys like me and guys that are alumni that can make a difference back and to back to, to give back and, and to be back so I'll we'll wrap up with that man I really appreciate you I know we went a couple different directions you know I hope some of it sank in. We'll maybe do this again in the future with some other stuff. But um, I applaud you guys, man. I applaud you for what you're doing, what you're going through. I wish you the best. I really hope you have, have a kick-ass season this year. And stay healthy. And work your butt off and make yourself make a name for yourself. Make a name for your program. Make a name for yourself. So thanks for having me. I appreciate it.